Hi folks, it's Dave, uh, the Mentocus guy. Sorry about that, I'm just doing some practice. Um, yeah, back for another episode of the Christian Family Show. Haha, <laughs> it's nice to be out here in Abbotsford. Everything's going pretty good. Um, you know, uh, we've been having an exciting day. Um, you know, everything has uh, been going well. Uh, nice weather, everything else. Uh, and I got exciting news. Uh, we got, haha, <laughs> we got a Daniel Day guy donated. Thanks, John, for donating uh, Danny O'Day. Uh, he's uh, pretty old. Wow. Hi, Dave. How you doing? I'm pretty old guy. Oh, you are. Yeah. Well, this is kind of different for me, being in a new home and everything. Oh, yeah. Well, hey, you're pretty old. Yeah. I come from the days of, you know, the old ventriloquist. Hey, Dave. Yeah? I got a request for you, a prayer request. Yeah, oh sure, anything, anything. Uh, you know, a good friend of mine passed away recently and I'd like to pray for his family. His name was Keith Harris. He was a very good ventriloquist and he was loved by many. Oh, I know Keith, I've heard about the news. I, you know what? Lord, I just pray for Keith and his family. He was a good inspiration to me, and I loved him a lot, and uh, he inspired me a lot, and I pray for his family. Um, he'll be missed a lot. Thanks, Dave. I'm uh, glad you get on with your show. Yeah, we'll we'll see you again. We'll have more talk. Uh, hey, look who we have here today, too. Hi, uh, hey, hey. It's Peanut Butter. Peanut Butter, how you doing? Oh, he's, he's, not, a, he's not awake yet. Let's see if we can get him turned on. Oh! Hi. My name is Peanut Butter. I am from Robot. Hi, Peanut Butter. How you doing? Uh, I'm pretty good. Um, I was just here over hearing about death. And Dave, how come I won't die? Wow, you're a robot, so you can't die. I can't die. That means I will never get to go to heaven. Oh well, you know you're a you're a machine and everything like that. Oh, Dave, will you please let me die one day? Oh well, I don't know if I could let you die, but I could turn your batteries off. Please, I want to go to heaven. Well. I don't know if you'll get to go to heaven, peanut butter, but you know what? Why don't you just sit back and I want to talk about death a little bit. You know, you can't go to heaven. Maybe God has a purpose for you one day, but only humans can go to heaven. And God, you know, he died for us. He died so we'll be able to have life. Um, it's wonderful. That's wonderful good news. Um, he died because we were able to be saved. John 20. Early on Sunday morning, while it was still dark, Mary Magdalene came to the tomb and found that the stone had been rolled away from the entrance. She ran and found Simon Peter and the disciples, the one who Jesus loved. She said, they have taken the Lord's body out of the tomb, and we don't know where they have put him. Peter and the other disciples started out for the tomb. They were running, but the other disciple outran Peter and reached the tomb first. He stooped and looked in and saw linen wrapping lying there, but didn't go in. Then Simon Peter arrived and went inside. He also noticed the linen wrappings lying there, while the cloth that had covered Jesus' head was folded up and lying apart from the other wrappings. Then the disciple who had reached the tomb first also went in, and he saw and believed, for until then they hadn't understood the scripture that Jesus said he must rise from the dead. Then they went home. Mary was standing outside the tomb crying, and as she wept, she stood and looked in. She saw two white-robed angels one sitting at the head and the other at the foot of the place where the body of Jesus had been lying. Dear woman, why are you crying? The angels asked her. 
Because they have taken my Lord away, she replied, and I don't know where they have put him. She turned to leave and saw someone standing there. It was Jesus, but she didn't recognize him. Dear woman, why are you crying? Jesus asked her. Who were you looking for? She thought he was the gardener. Sir, she said, if you have taken him away, tell me where you have put him, and I will go and get him. Mary, Jesus said. She turned to him and cried out, Rabboni, which is Hebrew for teacher. Don't cling to me, Jesus said, for I haven't yet ascended to the Father. But go find my brothers and tell them, I am ascending to my Father and to your Father, to my God and your God. Mary Magdalene found the disciples and told them, I have seen the Lord. Then she gave them his message. Wow, wow. You know, that angel of the Lord sure has good scripture verses. You know, um, I really, I really, I really enjoy that. Um, and we all, oh, holy moly, your warning system. That's good news, folks. When you hear that, it's not that a ho nuclear holocaust is coming. That means there's another signal of Christ's return. Woohoo! Yeah, that's, that's good news, guys. Oh, okay, take it easy. You know, um, the sign is, and it's not new, but it's, well, new for our generation, is they said before Christ's return, Israel will become a nation. <coughs> and it has. Back in the 40s, Israel became a nation. Christ said when Israel becomes a nation, then the hour of my return is soon. Woohoo! That's, that's great news. Well, we're waiting for more warning signal to come. Uh, yeah, so, I mean, I sure like uh, talking about uh, Jesus dying, come back for, from the grave to uh, rescue us. That's great. Um, yeah, so, I mean, that's not good with peanut butter here wanting to die, but, uh, oh, well, that's okay. Um, yeah. Oh! Hi, Dave! Oh, hi! hi. I just got in. What's up? <laughs> not too much. We've had a pretty good show so far. Great! <coughs> It's good to see you. Good to see you. Um, yeah, let's talk about us talking about how Christ died and uh, got resurrected. Amen. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Um, hallelujah. Yeah, hallelujah. Hey, Lord, hey, hey. Oh, hey, Dr. Needles. Oh, my goodness. Oh, 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 no. I got really bad news for both of you. Oh, no. What's wrong? Yeah. Oh, Sally. Oh, you better sit down for this. Uh, Franklin. He's in critical condition. He's had a very serious accident. Franklin! Oh, no! Uh, well, I can't divulge any information, but oh, you guys can visit him tomorrow after we get him stable. He's in intensive care in my hospital right now. Sorry about that, Sally. What happened to you now? Oh, I really don't know. Um, But he, I don't know if he's going to make it. You guys better pray. Oh, where's the exit? My painter's going off. I got more emergencies. Okay, well, I'm very sorry for the news. You better pray. I don't know if he's going to make it. Okay, i got to get Thanks, back to the Dr. hospital. Needles. Okay. Thanks, Dr. Needles. We'll see you later. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Oh, no. That's terrible. That's terrible. Franklin, that poor guy, he was, he was so scared all the time, too. I know. And I saw him earlier today. Oh. And he... Even though he was scared, he was up in the tree. Uh, he was looking for Granny Lanny. I you know that, she's coming back, and uh, he was trying to see if he could see her uh, down the road. I hope he didn't fall down and break his crown. Oh, oh poor. Well, let's try to sing a song anyway to get her mind off it, you know. Um, let's sing, I'm Forgiven, You Are My King. All right, Sally? You were condemned I'm alive and well Your spirit is within me Because you died and rose again Amazing love How can it be That you my king die for me. Amazing love, I know it's 
do And it's my joy to honor you In all I do I honor you You are my king about that folks I wasn't on there you know just my mind after that after that serious accident with Franklin oh, Sally Dave I think we should pray for I, him I think we better pray okay just a second okay oh sorry about that song I mean I love that song you're my king but I that bad news we better have a good prayer dear Lord I'm playing today for our friend Franklin. I ask you to surround him with doctors and nurses to care for him. And please surround his family and friends with your love. Please take care of him and, and bring him to health. I also pray for anyone else out there and their families and friends, for anyone who is suffering or sick or ill. Yeah. or in need of your love right now yeah. and your care. Yeah. Please bring the angels to everyone to surround yeah. them. Yeah. And if anybody wants to come to Jesus, I ask you yes. to join me in the sinner's prayer. Yes. Dear Lord, please forgive me for the things I have done. Please forgive me for the times you have needed me to be there and I haven't been. Please help me forgive others who have harmed me. And help me forgive, help them forgive me for things I have done. I ask you to accept me into your loving arms and into your kingdom. In the name of Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Well, thanks. Thanks for your donations. Please give us some of your puppets. Pray for Franklin. Um, yeah, it's been a good show. We're going to go and have a real good prayer session. Uh, thanks again. See you next time, folks, on the Christian Dummy Show. Yay!